welcome to our channel in this session we are going to discuss about parameter parsing where the concept of parameter parsing occurred you know the concept of function also called as procedure why we are using the procedure simple thing if a code is to be repeated multiple number of times instead of writing the code multiple number of times so write the code at one place that is called function or a procedure whenever we required simply we call that particular function yes now at the time of calling the function we need to pass some variables to the function that is called parameter passing means passing the parameters from the function call to function definition call to definition before going to discuss different ways of parameter passing first you need to know some basic terminology generally the parameters are two types actual parameters and the second one is a formal parameters what is actual and what is formal the parameters that are present in the function call the parameters that are in the function call are called actual parameter that is whatever the values we are passing are called actual parameters the parameters that are declared in the function definition that means the parameters that takes the value those are called formal parameter anyway i will explain with one example no problem along with you need to know two variables r value and l value r value and l value consider an assignment operator for example a is equal to 2 into 3 plus 4 this is an expression evaluate the expression it produces a single value now this is called r value or suppose a is equal to d this is also called as r value r value means a single value that is always appear right side of the assignment operator right side of the assignment operator now what is l value l value means simply a variable which consists of address l value stores the address or the memory location where my r value is stored for example if you are writing a statement a is equal to 5 in this example internally what happened some memory is created with some address and the value 5 is stored in this this 1000 is l value the 5 is r value okay just now know the definition now l value was the memory location where my value is stored or means simply a value now we have different ways of passing the parameters in this session we will discuss the main four ways one is call by value second one is call by reference third one is call by copy and restore call by copy and restore fourth one call by name so these are the four different ways of passing the parameters so okay we will discuss one by one first one call by value call by value in the sense simply we are passing the values from the 
function call to function definition we are passing just to value clearly speaking we are passing the or values consider one example by this example you will get the complete idea main int suppose a is equal to some 3 b is equal to 4 here i am printing a value print a comma b so write down the syntax percentage c percentage c a comma b that is not a matter now here i am calling one function swap of a comma b and then print of a b okay now whenever i call the swap function here swap of suppose int c int d here i declared one variable temporary suppose t is equal to c c is equal to d d is equal to temp like this now observe step by step call by value means here whenever we are calling the procedure this is called calling procedure this is called called procedure and in this a comma b are called actual parameters c comma d are called formal parameters c comma d are called formal parameters in this we are passing r value r value means just a value just a value now here what is the value of a 3 4 now 3 comma 4 are passed now c holds a value 3 d holds a value 4 as you here the address of a is some thousand the address of b is some two thousand here c and d the address is some four thousand the address is some five thousand clear both are two different memory locations now what happen if you perform any modification inside the procedure it does not affect why here i am just to pass the value simply this procedure takes the value perform the operation if you perform any modification see these addresses and these addresses are different if you done modification at this address, it does not affect this address. Suppose 3 comma 4, after performing operation, at this locations the values are changed. Now clear, call by value means simply any modification done in the formal parameters does not affect the actual parameter. Now what is the output? 3, 4, after calling, the completion control written back yes or no after that the output is 3 4 only this is called call by value now call by reference call by reference reference is also called as address here we are passing diagram is same sorry the program is same here instead of r value in call by reference we are passing l value passing l value means we are passing the address we are passing the address internally so originally this is the program internally how the compiler written the program the compiler change the program as ampersand a ampersand b that means address of a and address of b now internally how these two int star c int star d the compiler do this activity now what we are passing L value, L value means address. Now, here what is the address we are getting? 1000 and 2000, 3 and 4. Now, obviously, if you done any modification here, it affects or not? Yes. Why? Here we are doing the modification on the addresses. 
previously you are doing the modification in their own memory but in this case i am not passed the value here i passed the address it takes that particular address go to that memory location update the value here it updates the value automatically here also the values are updated 4 comma 3 clear what is the difference between first one and second one in the first one we are just passing the r value any modification done on the formal parameter does not affect on the actual parameter coming to the second one the second one is call by reference in this we are passing the l value l value means memory location any modification done on the formal parameter it updates the actual also that is second one third one call by copy and restore call by copy and restore internally what happened observe whenever we are calling the procedure whenever we are calling the procedure at the time of calling the procedure we are passing r value we are passing r value so here int c comma d their memory location suppose 3000 and 4000 both are different why similar to call by value by taking these values 3 comma 4 just copy the actual parameters into formal parameters then all the modification why here i just passed r value after completion remember after completion the control written back yes or no whenever the procedure is completed the control written back whenever it returns back whenever it returns back it restore that means it updates it updates the l value clear the point here i have just passed the value that is called copy after completion and whenever we return back it updates the l value it updates the well value in the sense the values are updated 4 3 4 3 observe the difference between call by reference and this one in call by reference we directly pass the address here also we are doing the operation in that address but in this we are not passing the address we just to pass it to the value perform the operation and coming back i update the addresses i update the addresses now this is the answer 4 comma 3 clear copy this is called restore restore actual to formal is called copy formal to actual is called restore finally the last one call by name call by name here what happened we are passing the parameters okay but internally this is the concept exactly yes or no generally this is the concept but internally how the compiler do the activity means int c comma d these are replaced with int a comma b t is equal to a a is equal to b b is equal to c observe what happened whenever we are calling the procedure all the formals are also replaced with actual the names of the actual parameters are in place of formal parameters that means it does not do another activity simply this is called lazy evaluation instead of internally this happened whenever you are call by name technique is applied 
internally this logic is there no new variables new formal parameters are not created all the formals are replaced with the actuals only these are the different ways of parameter passing to the procedures thank you